Hi, good day, welcome to our math class. Today's topic is about solving quadratic equation by completing the square. Before we go to our actual topic, let's have a review first. We have here a quadratic equation, y squared plus 8y plus 16 equal to 0. Our review will be all about a perfect square trinomial. Ano ba ang ibig sabihin ng perfect square trinomial? I-explain natin yung terms one by one. Let's have perfect square. And we have trinomial. Yung trinomial madali lang. Pag sinabing trinomial, three terms. So ito ay example ng trinomial. We have 1, 2, 3. So, 3 terms, we call it trinomial. So, we're done with trinomial. Ano naman pag sinabing perfect square? Yung perfect square, mas madalas natin yung na-encounter in terms of numbers. So, magbibigay ako na examples ng mga perfect square numbers. Like 9, 16, and 25. Bakit ba sila tinawag na perfect square? Kasi kapag tinactor natin yung 9, so we can have 3 times 3. Ang factor ng 16 is 4 times 4. Ang factor ng 25 is 5 times 5. So they have similarities. Ibig sabihin, pag sinabi natin perfect square, yung factor nila ay pareho. So, we have 3 and 3, 4 and 4, 5 and 5. So, pag pinagsama natin, perfect square trinomial, so, ito ay trinomial na kung saan ang factor ay pareho. etong quadratic equation na to, y squared plus 8y plus 16, is one of the examples of a perfect square trinomial. Ulitin natin, when we say perfect square trinomial, it is a trinomial wherein ang kanyang factor ay pareho. Gaya ng binanggit ko kanina, ito ay perfect square trinomial. Ngayon, let's try to prove na ito nga ay perfect square trinomial by getting its factors. So, ayan ay can be factored we have two quantities. Kung naalala nyo pa yung step on how to factor trinomials, we have y here and then y. Then, ito yung sum. Pag pinag-add mo ay 8. And then, ito yung product. Pag pinag-multiply mo, dapat 16. Think of two numbers na kapag pinag-add mo ay 8 and kapag pinag-multiply mo ay 16. Yes, we have 4 and 4. 4 plus 4 is 8. 4 times 4 is 16. Now, look at the result of our factors. Katulad ng binanggit ko kanina, tinawag siyang perfect square dahil ang factor niya ay pareho. Kagaya lang ng mga ibang perfect square numbers like 25, like 36, and the others. Then, pwede pa natin tong isimplify by writing it this way, y plus 4 squared is equal to 0. Katulad ng sa 25. So, on 25, for example, ihalin tulad natin yan sa y squared plus 8y plus 16. Ngayon, kung kukunin natin yung factor ng 25, katulad nitong factor na to, so, ang magiging factor niyan ay 5 times 5. And, we can write it this way. Ang 5 times 5, pwede natin isulat as 5 squared. So, I hope na kuha niyo yung ibig kong sabihin about perfect square trinomial. Itong part na to ay kasama sa mga steps on how to solve quadratic equation by completing the square. Kaya, wag niyong kalilimutan.